You have stayed and worked in Canada consistently for the last 40 years, probably 38 or, or, or more years. Why is that? And do you recommend staying and working here to other young actors? I think I probably know the answer to that question, but I have to ask. Um, the, the first may be a, a very personal thing or how I feel about it. Uh, I, want to, uh, I want to work where I want to live. That's basically it. I got in this business, I swear to you, for friendship more than almost anything else. I hadn't thought of celebrity, I hadn't thought of uh, money in that regard. I figured those things would come along with. Right. So with me, it was friendship, looking for new friends. And right across this country, I was able to go every city, major city, and, uh, and so on, and, um, and just enjoy, yeah. enjoy that. And I brought that feeling that I felt we, about the place and about the people, uh, without sounding as though I'm a politician here, you know, and, and, and I just brought it with me wherever I went. And it added to the, uh, I think, the, uh, you know, the final picture. Right, right. So there was that. There was a time when, in fact, a few of us were thinking, what's, what's the difference? I mean, it's our business. We should think in a more worldly fashion. Right. I mean, you know, that, that, that can be done, my feeling, that can be done here. Uh, you know, I think it's high time, for heaven's sake, that, that we, we drop some of our, uh, per, uh, you know, parochialisms and, and, and just simply, but think mainly of the work we do, how we do it. Not that, not that we will do less in quality or, or anything else. We'll do less in quantity, perhaps, mm -hmm. but surely the work is going to be so much more meaningful if you happen to devote special time with special people, and uh, and it would and it would appear to be, uh, and, and then it could be uh, kind of solid enough that you didn't need all the all the rest of it. But there's a trap because, in fact, you can feel. Oh, I guess if I stay, I'm not, uh, I'm still not quite up to par. You don't believe that, you don't believe it to begin with. You think that they do or it does outside, but uh, it's up to you in your head. The border is blurred in your head. You've got to just get on with the business of doing things, things that are important uh, in your field the way you feel about things, and uh, I think that that should be enough. It's not a, it's not a, a huge thing. If you feel huge resistance, yes, fine. One of the, there is resistance in a sense today with certain kinds of people that are being uh, compatriots of yours or whatever, you know, who are devoting themselves to uh, to the outside interest. Nothing wrong with that. Mm -hmm. I remember, as you mentioned, when I was down there. We weren't able to get the starring roles. We weren't able to get all of that stuff. Right. First of all, people were leaving the major screens from the golden age, at the end of the golden age, and moving over into, into that. Yeah. Um, uh, you know, very, very seldom were people on the, on the rise, you know, and doing, doing equal work with, with the, the American uh, uh, individual. Uh, Lauren Green was one. He did fine. Right. Um, and Leslie. Yeah, Leslie Nielsen. Leslie. Yeah. Uh, gosh, almost anyone else. I can't. I would say they were simply waiting in line like, like the rest of us. The work that you wanted to do, uh, you quite forgot yeah. about. And you were lucky to get any work at all. And if you, if you got it, you would make the most of it. Right. Making the most of it is fine, but it's not necessarily, uh, the, the plan you had, I believe, you know, or could have. In this country, and I think it was Sarah who said too, something about the business of, uh, it, it, staying and getting something done. Getting, getting a, a show done. It was so important. Be, uh, and you knew that you were going for the very best product because so few shows right. are being done. Yeah. 
So if you know, you know, it's not as though you, they were done easily. It's not as though you got your money easily or anything else. But then you've, you've, so, so it's, uh, in a strange way, it takes on a, a value that's far greater than, uh, than the other. Um, you know, there was a time. I mean, we, we had, we had certain things going in the way of, uh, television series when television was still warm here. Uh, you know, the last of the Mohicans, Hudson's Bay, and, right. um, you know, now and then the Canadian one, RCMP, would sneak in. So, you know, some of that was happening then. But right across this country in early television, and I was looking at it from Winnipeg, you began to know every face because there were so few to yeah. really, uh, you know, we had, we had nothing. But as soon as we had choice, everybody fell for it. And, and not everybody in the way of talent. But, I mean, yes, that would have been useful, too. But um, very soon, in the late 50s, early 60s, industry names were being used from the States. Mm -hmm. And in, every, in some people's terms, that's what made the difference. Uh, oh, yes, now we can get on and we can do some important stuff, you know. Mm -hmm. And that, that, to me, was... It was kind of weird. You've got to stick to your guns to some degree, and if you have good stuff going in, keep that. Don't don't distort it. Don't don't mis, you know mold it to suit everyone else. Just bring your own stuff with you and uh, see where it'll go. It's been tough. It's just hard, and that's all there is to it. I, I just don't know how one hangs on. The longevity thing is the only thing that's worked for me. Run fast, or they'll ask you to dance. You know, you got it. You got to just keep going, keep moving, and uh, so one is able to do that. The work that I've done, I hate to be the one to say it. I was not. You know, a lot of it is not that great. What happens? <laughs> but if I if I was my career was stopped at each of those moments, right? Then, no, we're not going to remember that tomorrow. But it's because it's all joined together. It's right. It's a string of pearls. Yeah. <laughs> and it becomes kind of, hey, Gordon, wow, you've been at this a yeah. long time and you've made a living. Yes. You know. <laughs>